Hi, my name is Gotze from MP3 Car, and today we're going to talk about ACPI over USB with the Carnatic's P2140. So the supplies you'll need um, to make this work is your uh, P2140, and you'll uh, need to wire it in your car. If you uh, are not sure how to do that, look at some of our previous videos in the manual um, to see how uh, you need to do it. Your laptop or some other computer. Um, you will need a USB cable going in from your P2140 to your laptop. It's a Type B to Type A USB cable. And don't mind all these wires, they're some extras that you will need. From a software standpoint, to make, um, to make the whole thing work, uh, you'll need to have PSU Money installed. The latest version that ships with the firmware uh, on the P2140 is version 1.8.3 and you can that get that at connects.com forward slash support <clears throat> um, so make sure you have PSU money installed and running on your PC to make sure it works and the only way it's gonna work is PSU money needs to be running all the time uh, in order for the ACPI over USB to work so um, I have Vista running on my laptop which kinda sucks uh, but I'm gonna and I'm going to make some uh, Vista changes um, that you probably won't need to do if you're running XP or uh, another operating system. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is I have this PSU money shortcut on my desktop, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make sure that the PSU money application runs as an administrator. Uh, because if it doesn't, it won't pick up the 2140 when you plug it into the laptop. So uh, go right click into on the PSU Mine shortcut, go into the, pro into the properties, and go into compatibility. There you go. And up here at the bottom, you see privilege level. Make sure this box is clicked which means run this program as an administrator. Click OK. Um, and that way, next time you launch PSU Money, thank you Vista, it will recognize that the PSU Money or the P2140 is connected to uh, your laptop. OK, um, so that's about it. You might need to make some uh, uh, device manager changes in control panel some people have had to do this um, so I'm gonna really uh, point out where it's at so you're gonna go into uh, device manager system actually system device manager the other way around and we're gonna wait till it loads um, you're gonna expand the other devices line and there's the PSU Money P2140 device you're gonna right click on it you're gonna go into properties and you're gonna click on the power management tab so you see there's two lines here uh, with two checkboxes uh, the first one is allow the computer to turn off this device to save power you wanna make sure that's not clicked you don't want your computer turning off uh, the 2140 or disconnecting the connection um, and the second checkbox is allow this device to wake the computer. Make sure that's checked. And click OK. You're going to close that. And then we're going to make another change. And for this, you're going to need to go into PSU Money. And you're going to click on the Settings button. Uh, so there's a whole bunch of soft switches in here. What you're going to need to do is make sure that in this box, uh, which is titled shut down control signal so make sure uh, the switch is um, toggled towards the enable USB so you're going to enable the P2140 to send the startup and shutdown signal over the USB um, and my laptop is set to shut down uh, in standby mode so you might need to do it differently and they're going to need there are going to be some complications, but for right now we're just going to explain standby mode. Make sure you click the update jumpers button and you're set to go. Now that we've installed PSU Money and we've made the necessary software changes, we're just going to 
uh, demo uh, how ACPI over USB works really quick and what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna flip my car ignition switch to off and this is just an on off switch that is in line on the ignition wire yellow wire on the P2140 so um, we're just gonna flip this off and if you see PSU money um, it shows you the status so right now it's shutdown delay and right now it's ACPI so it's actually sending the ACPI over USB and the laptop is going into standby mode uh, you'll see the LED on the P2140 is blinking which means the P2140 is going through its shutdown procedure and in about 10 seconds or so the fans gonna turn off alright so the whole system right now is in standby and I mentioned there was a whole bunch of wires um, in the back at the beginning of this video and what that actually is is my uh, amp meter so I put an amp meter in line on my constant going to the P2140 and as you can see the readout it said it's almost 300 milliamps so that means my P2140 and my laptop are drawing about 300 milliamps from my battery while they're in standby mode so just really sure that's really really bad for your battery and it's probably going to drain it in a few days if you leave your car just sitting there so um, we're going to get, get back to that later to see if we can fix it because I don't want my uh, car battery dead so right now uh, back to my uh, ignition I'm going to turn it to on turn my car to on to see if this whole thing actually worked So, as you saw, my uh, the P2140 sent the startup signal over USB to the laptop, and my laptop boot into screensaver mode.